Adobe Illustrator offers a lot of ways you can fine tune the appearance of text in your projects. In this particular project, you'll create some headline text and apply formatting options like typekit fonts, size, and color to make it look better. To follow along with the latest version of Illustrator CC Open, open your own Illustrator document or this practice file from the downloadable practice files for this tutorial. To see all the content, choose View, Fit All in Window. To get started, you'll add some text to the project. So select the Type tool in the Tools panel on the left, come out into a blank area somewhere in the document, and drag to create an area of text. Type Designs Made Simple to replace the placeholder text. This text needs some formatting help. It needs to be larger, have a different font applied to give it a different appearance, and a few more options. To apply formatting like font and size, you'll select the text with the Type tool. But if all the text in an area has the same formatting applied, you can simply select the Type object with the Selection tool. Click and drag across all of this text to select it. Most of the formatting for your text is found in the Properties panel to the right of the document. There are a lot of text formatting options you can experiment with, including font, font size, letting, and more. To change the font for the text, click the Font Family menu. While you can choose from the list of fonts in your machine, let's see how to search for and add fonts from the thousands available on Adobe Typekit, which is part of your Creative Cloud membership. Click Add Fonts from Typekit in the Font Family menu. The Typekit website should open in your default browser as long as you have an internet connection. On the Typekit website, click Show Filter if you need, so you can sort the fonts based on properties like serif, sans serif, and explore different fonts to find just the right one. Your available list of fonts might look different than what you see here, depending on the type of Creative Cloud membership you have and which fonts you've already installed. And keep in mind that Adobe is always adding more fonts to Typekit for its members. To search for a font, come to the search field at the top of the page and type Lado. Hover the pointer over the font in the list and click to select it. You can then sync a font style. Syncing a font makes it available on your computer and also available to all of your other Creative Cloud apps. Find Lado Black and click to sync it. Once you've chosen your font, back in Illustrator, click the Font Family menu and you can filter by Typekit in the Font Family menu to see your newly installed font, and then click to apply that font. Change the font size to 36 by choosing 36 from the Font Size menu. You may find now that some of the text is hidden. If that's the case, select the Selection tool and drag a corner of the Type object to show all the text. Then bring the pointer over the text and drag it into position like you see here. To change the color fill of the text, click the fill color in the Properties panel to the right. Make sure the swatch option is selected so you can see a series of default colors, and then select the green swatch. Click away from the text until you deselect it. As you can see, Illustrator offers a lot of text formatting options you can explore. From formatting logo type to fine tuning the appearance of text in app design, you can now format your own text to match your design needs. Save a copy of the file by choosing File, Save As, and make sure to name it something different. That way you preserve the original practice file. 